success literally since the day it opened and our success is largely down to the fact that it was a really strong product based on playful learning methodology with hands-on galleries and exhibits and over the years the continued creative input that's gone into making sure that we're at the leading edge in terms of uh, children's issues and activities and their interests really. About three years ago we came up with a, uh, a new way of thinking about an existing exhibition called Me and My Body and that's where we decided to come up with the new gallery, uh, find the funding for it and deliver a new exceptional experience about health and well-being. The launch of the, um, the new gallery itself is saying, the biggest thing that's happened here at Eureka in 20 years. Um, and it's a very significant project. It's a very, very exciting future. The lead fund of this gallery was the Wellcome Trust, which donated 1.45 million. And the three key funders after the Wellcome Trust have been the Stavros Niarchos Foundation, a Greek-based foundation, uh, Wolfson, and Garfield Weston. The Wellcome Trust is all about uh, trying to achieve improvements, extraordinary improvements in human and animal health. It's very important for us that children from a very young age have a really good understanding of science, of their bodies, and this was an ideal project. It complements the formal learning in the, in the classroom with then the informal activity, and I think will we'll enable those young people as they grow up to have a much better grounding and understanding of how one's body works and, and why it's important to look after it. It's fantastic, it's so bright and light. You can see your children, this learning so much. Just to see the way that families are interacting together is just great. We've seen lots of adults actually playing as well, which is always great to see family units playing together, mums, dads, grandmas, granddads, all, all together, it's been wonderful. Having children involved in everything we do is so important. Children are at the heart of Eureka and of course are at the heart of the new All About Me exhibition. If like they do ask children, it might not be as good as if they did ask children and the children's opinion is like Important. If they just use the adults' ideas, it might just be a bit too complicated. And because we're children, we know what we enjoy. We've been asked like feedback of what we think, whether we could add more to it, or um, whether we like it, and what else we could add to it. And think. Taking children from a wide variety of groups and social situations gives us a real um, breadth of, of consultation. We have taken a completely new approach helping children understand the importance of their bodies, but in a way that is just completely fun for them. All of these exhibits have been designed so that they are accessible for a range of audiences and ages. Also, parents, carers and adults will be able to join in too. It's fantastic. We In year one, we teach about the senses, and we do that at the beginning of the year, and this just moves so much on from that. It's looking at the world of work and how it relates to real life, and the children really enjoy that. Yeah, the children have loved getting into role, and especially in the dentist area, getting on the chair, pretending to be dentists, looking in the mouths and at the teeth and things. I've really enjoyed it. I think it's brilliant. I think the fact that she can touch everything and not be told to put it down and be quiet constantly is brilliant. And I think it's not just for the science of the, of the body. It so develops the language, the literacy, um, and their communication with one another. And it's really lovely to watch them. It's prompted lots of conversations, lots of starting topics for the children to talk about with the adults, which is always really good to see. There's no doubt about it. The favourite part of the gallery for me is the new skeleton bike. At the moment, my favourite bit is the, the brain area. I'm really looking forward to seeing the giant nose. I gather you can crawl into it, but I'm probably a bit too big for that. If I had to choose a favourite, it would be the baby clinic. Um, particularly the, the mum with the ultrasound is absolutely great where the children can do the scanner and see what the baby looks like and actually feel it as well. I've got to say, Zoom is my favourite. I love the robot. She loves the teeth. And it's more about her, I suppose, isn't it? I think the unique thing about our approach is that children don't even know they're learning. They're just having fun. And so when they enter and they see everything before them and all these opportunities to play and have fun and dress up, they're just going to be so excited. 